know in Minority Report captured the public imagination, but the, the reality is those kind of interfaces are, are great for camera. You know, if the director... But you can't use them. Yeah, exactly. They're, they're sexy, just like a transparent display is, but they're not at all necessarily functional. I went to Acedia, which is this home theater thing, and people are touting multi-touch coffee tables like, like a fake surface table. But it turns out he just meant that you could have a beer on the table at the same time as you're touching it, and it won't confuse the sensor. You hit the nail right on the head about there's a lot of confusion going up because everyone's trying to make this buzz, you know, capture yeah. the buzz of multi-touch. Nano. And, Our biggest yeah. problem right now is that multi technically means more than one in English, so yeah. there are a lot of people out here trying to say, oh, we can do two-touch. And two just being more than one in English for yeah. multi, but that's not at all capturing the kind of capability we have where every pixel here is a touch sensor. So we literally have an infinite number of points we can capture. The reason we're able to do such great it's software and all the cool applications on top is because the fidelity of our data is so much higher than any other uh, device that's out there. Okay. Yeah, well, those kind of devices are also quite different. Like, this is quite different from the iPhone, just because of the scale of the device. Yeah. The iPhone and the HTC Touch and everything, you know, you can barely get two or three fingers on it. So, yeah. you know, I, I almost don't qualify that as a multi-touch platform. So you the ability to use both your hands and also fingers, uh, you know, really leverage a lot of those parts of the brains you're used to interacting with physical objects. Um, we're also quite focused on the fact that we can make our multi-touch screens quite large, so it can allow multiple yeah. people to work together. Cameras in the back as opposed to, like, no, no, capacitance? No, no, this is actually a, a true pressure sensor. Our technology basically transduces pressure into light, and yes, cameras or image sensors behind pick that signal up, okay. but it's not actually seeing your hands or anything like gotcha. that. Gotcha. I think some guy did a... Because I can use a stylus or anything else like that, the same thing. As long as it's pressure. Exactly. Okay, you can bring up the keyboard. How'd you get keyboard? How'd you get the word keyboard? Real time. Oh, wow. pulled the first 16 images off of Flickr. If you're writing an email to your mom, do you like go to the multi-touch? No, no. We don't advocate this as a replacement for everything. It's just uh, theoretical at this point? No, it's a different kind of interface. Oh, Some wow. things are always going to be good for what they're good for, uh -huh. like typing. You never... And this kid can get it too. And the kids love it, you know. Yeah, the kids oh, do love it. Kids, have kids love it. They get it. Yeah, they get it. I mean, these interfaces are so powerful for for not us or yeah. part of computing culture, but for for kids, for my parents, grandparents, CXOs, you know, five-star generals, you know, people whose job is not to know how to use a computer.